Hello, my name is Donald from PCE Americas, and today I'm going to be demonstrating the color meter, the PCE CSM-1. This is the color meter, and this is the way it comes in a box with the software and a user's manual. We have a nice case for the color meter with a handle. And here's, this is the PCE CSM-1 color meter. We have a power adapter. We have the USB cable. We have another adapter that goes on the end. This is a dust cover. Also, we have the white space and a carrying strap. Calibration, we enter. And it says place on the white space. We're doing so. Enter. Calibrating. Succeeded. White, white space is good. We're going to black. For black, all we do is enter. Now we hold it in the air. Success. Exit. Now we'll set the allowable tolerance. Go into menu. Go over to tolerance. Enter. On. Zero, zero, point four, zero. That's good. That's where we want it. So we're going to leave it right there. Exit. The tolerance value is set by the user and depends on the amount of deviation that the user wants to allow between the reference and the sample. We are going to set the number of measurements we are taking on the sample. To do that, we go into the menu and to average, enter. Uh, it's set at zero, four. So four times on each sample. The PCE CSM-1 color meter is able to measure in three different color spaces. There they are. I pick this one, C-I-E-L-A-B. We are ready to start our sample measurement. We want all four of these tiles to be the standard for each of these colors. These are all going to be the samples, and we'll find out if they pass or fail according to the color of these standards colors we're going to be setting up. We're going to do it four times. One, two, three, four. Our average is set for our standard. Now we we're going to check the samples. This is our first sample. One, two, three, four. Notice that it says Delta E failed. This color failed by 1.38 and the Delta E from the previous color, which was our standard. Now we're ready to check sample two. There's one. Two, three, and four. We can see that delta E failed on this color 1.26 from our standard. There's our standard on the left. Okay, we're finished with this standard. Now we're gonna move up to this gray standard, which means that we have to delete all records and reestablish our starting point with this color. So we go into menu, we go down, to delete, enter, delete all records, go down, enter, delete everything, yes. Now we're ready to set our new standard and record our standard. If you want to look at your readings, you can go into the record menu and go one, two, three. As you can see, the PCE CSM-1 color meter is easy to use, and if you have any questions, give us a call, and we're here to help.